my name is Anna. I'm a group fitness instructor from Sunshine Leisure Center. So today we're going to go through some Pilates exercise. It's a great way to strengthen your core and your back and also for your flexibility and mobility. All right, so if you're a first timer, please watch out for lower options and if you're in a precondition, please check with your doctors and as well as if you are pregnant on your first trimester. Unfortunately, the following exercise is not suitable for pregnancy if you are in your second or third trimester. And it's always handy if you have bottled water and exercise towels right beside you. Hi, right, and watch out. Um, um, yet again, um, if you want to take a break at any time, by all means, do so. All right. So today, Pilates, we're getting to sit onto the floor first. All right. Extend your legs. Yeah, and just move your hip one at a time. Yeah, to help us establish our pelvis. So we're going to warm up our back, entire back. So we're going to fold forward. So let's lift our chest, yeah, breathe in. Now as you breathe out, yeah, see if we can maintain our chest lift. All right, just watch, just pretend that someone's putting on top of your head, yeah, keep on lengthening the spine, and then slowly fold your body into half, rather than trying to reach your toes, yeah? We don't want to put unnecessary pressure on our lower back. So keep on pulling, yeah, fold. All right, you may want to place your hands beside your legs, yeah? Or you can place your hands onto your ankle. It's up to you. All right, breathe in. Now, as you breathe out, see if we can bring your eyebrows parallel to your pelvis. Now, you may want to just wiggle your shoulders slightly so we can bring your forearms and your elbows down. Now, this is too much for you, lower option. You may want to bend your knees slightly and let your belly rest onto your thigh. Wrap around your toes and then fold. All right, one more breath. And then slowly walk with your hands backward and then come back to the center. All right, bend your knees and give your knees a hug and just quickly check that there's nothing behind you. Now we're going to roll onto our back. Yeah, let's go rocking back, come up. All right, okay, so breathe in, roll back, breathe up, come on up. All right, we've got four more. So bring your thigh to your belly, come up as you breathe out. Allow your head to rest, big breath out, come up. All right, chin tuck in, breathe out. Two more. One more. Okay, we're gonna progress from here. So we adjust again, yeah? Move your hip, yeah? One by one. All right, glue your legs together and lift your heels and toes pointing at the ceiling. We're gonna place our hands underneath your knees. All right, chest lift again, yeah? All right, breathe in. Gather your breath as you breathe out. See if we can just gently tilt back, yeah? So you can feel more on your thigh and your core. All right, try not to drop your shoulder. All right, maintain your chest lift back straight. Eye gaze to your knees and then slowly come back to the center. All right, let's try three more, all right? Glue your legs together, yeah, as tight as you can. Breathe in again. As you breathe out, tilt back. All right, if you feel comfortable, release your arms. All right, slowly come back to the center. All right, two more, breathe in. Breathe out, eye gaze to your knees, hold, chest lift, Slowly come back to the center. All right, one more. Breathe in. Relax your shoulder. Breathe out. All right, come back to the center. Yeah, hold. All right, place your hands underneath your knees again. All right, we're going to lift our right heel up, right heel down. Left heel. Yeah, just awakening our legs and your hip flexing. Two more. All right, hold. This is your level one. All right, level two. Right knee up, left knee up. All right, and come to the table here. Hold, chest lift, and look at your toes or your knees. All right, now if you feel comfortable, by all means, open up your arms. Yeah? And then just gently chin up and look at the room. Breathe in and out. Slowly 
heels down, hands back to your knee, hold. All right, so we have one more set. All right, so we can always stay here. All right, this is your level one. Yeah. You can always stay here. All right, or we can climb up here. So what we did before, or advance, yeah, we can wave your arm just to celebrate Happy Wednesday. Yeah, chin up, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We can clap. All right, ten more. Three, two, one, hold. Whew. Slowly come on back down. Bring your knees to your chest. Give your knees a one, big hug. Oh, you sure feel that. All right, we get to extend our legs one more time. All right, glue your legs together again. Yeah, reset, readjust. All right, extend your arms. All right, chin tuck in again. So this time we want to warm up our lumbar here. So we're trying to create a C curl. All right, so on our tailbone. So relax your fingertips, right? Toes are pointing and ceiling. Eye leads to your knees, breathing again. As you breathe out, just gently roll back again, hold. Breathing, breathe out, see if we can relax your shoulders. Hold. All right, if you want a little bit more, simply tilt back even more. Hold. So try your very best. Yeah, your heel should be anchored to your mat. Roll back again. Squeeze. So your abs here, your core should be start shaking. Yeah, roll back again. Hold. All right, one big breath in as you breathe out. Come on up. Come on up. Think about your belly button now. Yeah, so then someone's using their index finger, push all the way to the end of the spine. All right, okay, one more round. Woo. All right, this is too much for you. Yeah, you can always place your hands on your knees again, tilt back and forward, yeah, to warm up your back. All right, okay. Relax your fingertips, relax your shoulder. Eye knees to your knees, pull back again. Breathe out. Relax your neck, relax your shoulder, tilt back. All right, think about your belly button, roll back again, hold. Roll back again, hold. Squeeze, squeeze your legs, squeeze your stomach, go back, squeeze your butt, hold. Stay here, all right, big breath out, slow up, up. Okay, one more, but this time we're gonna lie on the back. Yeah, all the way back, all right? So readjust, reset, all right, okay. One more, breathing, breathe out, tilt back. Go back again, go back again, take your time. Yeah, don't rush. Squeeze your thigh and your knees. Squeeze your stomach. Breathe out. arms above your head oh, and take a rest take a one big breath in and slow breath out all right one more breathe in let your belly rise like a balloon as you breathe out let your stomach sink into your spine to help us to create a neutral spine all right bend your right knee and your left knee all right bring your right knee to your chest give your right knee a hug just help you to release some tensions on your lower back. All right, and then alternate. All right, we're gonna to come to classical tabletop positions. So we're gonna bring our right knee up and the left knee up. All right, so quick checklist, yeah. So if you were here last week, yeah, we establish a checklist. Heel knee aligned, your knees and your thigh should be aligned. All right, so without lifting your head between your kneecaps, you should be able to see your, the first two toes, yeah, if you can see your entire feet, your bench is too high, if you can't see, that means your bench is too low, all right, so push your thighs away, so make sure that it doesn't come too close to your belly, because otherwise your belly will pop, prevent you to activate your inner layer of core, which is our powerhouse, all right, so we're going to open up our arms, turn your forearm and your palm facing to the ceiling, relax your shoulder, and we're going to stay here for two breaths, all right, so breathe in, let your belly rise up like a balloon as you breathe out. Let your stomach sink. Right. So lower option, you may want to toe tap onto the floor, but be mindful you still have to be 
Focus on your neutral spine. Yep. Try and let your belly sink. Breathe in again and then breathe out. Hold. Alright, we're gonna open up our knees. Your heels are um, joining together, toes are facing outward. Alright? So you can push your just gently use your hand to push your knees away so you can feel your hip and feel your groin. Hold. Alright, now we're gonna just gently pausing forward and back. Yeah, forward and back. So you can feel your thighs. Right? Relax your fingertips. We've got five more. <sighs> Four. Alright, this is too much for you. Toe tap onto the floor. This is your lower option. Alright. Two. One. Back to the center. Hold. Bring your feet together. Toe tap onto the floor. Alright, take a little breather. Breathe in and then breathe out. Alright, back to your tabletop, right knee up, left knee up. Alright, we're going to return to our Pilates view work again. Hold, yeah, push your knees out. Alright, now we're going to just gently extend your legs to 45 degrees. Alright, hold, and then slowly come back to the center. Alright, push away, breathe in and out. So yet again, this is too much for you. Yeah, toe tap onto the floor, open your knees. There. Yeah, hold, stretch it out, and open your knees again. Yeah, breathe out. Two more. One more. Come back to the center. Hold. Feet together, knees together, toes down to the floor, and then relax. All right, this time bring your left knee to your chest. Keep your left knee at home. Right knee to your chest, and your right knee up. Right. All right, take a breather again. <sighs> I want to like, just like move your back a little bit. Yeah, I have to readjust. All right, back to your tabletop. So earlier we established we can stay here. Yeah, we can also stay here. All right. All right, we can also stay here. All right, so we're gonna add a little bit more. All right, we're gonna do a heels tap. Yeah, just gently, gentle pose. You can feel your thighs, you can feel your legs, and also feel your core as well. All right, okay, now lower option, bend your knees. Yeah. Two is still too much for you. You can lift your right knee up, toe tap, left knee up, toe tap. That's your lower option. All right, okay, so I'm gonna go straight to advance. Yeah, heels tap, 20. Just gentle. All right, for those of you advanced, yeah, you can work down a little bit lower. The lower that you go, harder it gets. But just be mindful, your tailbone, your shoulder should be anchored to the floor, yeah? All right, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, feet together, bend your knee, and then slowly come down, and then relax. Oh, right knee to your chest, keep your right knee up. Left knee to your chest, keep your left knee up. Alright, a little bit of a pumping uh, stretch. We're going to bring your right knee up, yeah? Click on your ankle and then fold. So make sure you flex your feet to protect your ankle and your knee. So make sure your ankles are placed in the middle of your thigh. Alright, use your right hand, just gently push your knee down. Slowly release, all right? Open your arms again. Your right leg just gently go across to your left side, yeah? So your both knees are across. Your both knee turn to the back of the room as your head turn towards me. All right, this is too much for you, yeah? You can always unwrap both, stack your knees together. Yeah, this is your lower option. If you notice that your opposite shoulder is lifting, Gently, we can wiggle ourselves back. Yeah. You notice the things, wiggle yourself back and help us to open our chest. All right, back to the center. Let's try on the other side. Back knee up, fold. Push your knee down. All right, 
back, slowly release, yeah? Open up your arms, cross your legs, bring your knees towards me as your head turns to the back of the room this time. Breathe out your back. Relax your arms. All right, slowly come back to the center. Hold. All right, release. All right, so now we're going to extend your right leg this time, yeah? All right, use your two hands to support your knee. Toes are pointing towards you, yeah? Make sure your feet are parallel to the floor. All right, so option, we can climb a little bit higher, yeah, if you can, yeah, without lifting your head off the floor. All right, or you may want to climb even higher towards your ankle. Now straighten your knees as much as you can, yeah, and bring your thigh closer to your belly. Now if you have an exercise towel, by all means, hook onto your foot, yeah, and draw your um, thigh forward. If your back feels comfortable, by all means, extend your back leg, but your heel do not touch the floor. Yeah, so now you can feel the two-way stretch on your both legs. All right, bend your front knee, bend your back knee, simply switch over. front knee, hold, alright, so that was option one, alright, option two, yeah, reset again on your right leg, climb, alright, extend, now this time big breath out, see if we can bring your chest to the thigh, yeah, hold, alright, slowly come on back down, simply switch over, Bend your knees, slowly come down. All right, advance, yeah. Climb up. Switch over, hold, we've got 20. Breathe out, breathe out. forward, scoop your belly, all the way up, 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 so squeeze your back, squeeze your glute, yeah, so you can feel your hamstrings, your thigh and your strong back, this is great for your mobility, back and your core. Alright, slowly roll your hip down, just gently, 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 gently. Alright, until you come back to the floor. Right. If you have a um, back issue, please remain where you are, otherwise, open your knees, bring your heels and your toes joined together, come to like a butterfly pose, fold your arms and place your arms above your head. 
Now you notice that there's a little bit of a, a, your arch is lifting from your back, so gently tilt your pelvis forward one more time. Scoop your belly up to flatten your back, to protect your back. All right, fold. Let your arms and your shoulder rest onto the floor. Now this is too much for you. You can always open your arms to the side again. Yeah. Wherever your arms feel comfortable. Two more breaths. One more. Bring your knees together. Come up with your arms, bring your knees to your chest. Stack your knees, turn your knees towards me. Your back can come in front of your chest. Push yourself up. All right, we have one more stretch. All right, extend your legs. Okay, bend your knees. All right. Lift your right foot, place it outside of your left leg. Use your left hand to hug. And turn around, look at back. All right, this is too much for you. You can always place your hands outside the ankle and rotate on the other side. All right, back to the center. Pick on your ankle, yeah? Place it above your knee and push your knees down. It's a bit like this, what we did before while we're lying on the floor. All right, lift your right arm, your right hand, place it outside of your thigh and then slide all the way to your calf or maybe just your knees, yeah? If you're more flexible, go to your calf or down to your ankles. Breathe out again, see if you can slide your hand all the way down to your toes. Right, slowly climb up. Let's try on the other side. Give it a little shake. Hug. Elongate your spine, chest lift. Step over. Hug and turn. Back to the center. Pick onto your ankle, fold. Push your knees down. Alright, lift your left arm. Left hand, place it outside your knee and just gently slide, hold. If you can go down, yeah, further down or even all the way down to your toes. Right, slowly come on up. Okay, release. Bend your knees and just gently sit on your heel. This is too much for you, bring your knees apart. Yeah, still too much for you here. Come to normal sitting positions. Okay, advance. You may want to tuck your toes. Yeah. And let your buttock to rest onto your heels. So stay where you are, you can turn to the back. Yeah, so it's really nice toes and your will your foot stretch. Place your hands forward, release your toes, come to child pose, extend your arms, push your hips back. Just gently lighten your arms, lighten your heavy back and your hips. And let your belly rest onto your thighs, forehead on the ground. One more. Right, slowly come up, roll your shoulders to the back of the room, forward, lift your chest and just bring your eye gaze to the right side of the wall and look down to your right shoulders and move your neck stretch. Back to the centre, simply turn on to the left side and then look down. Come back to the centre. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy your Pilates. I'll see you next time. Have a great day.